Rob Askins wrote this play in 2011. He wrote it with Stephen and I in mind. And from the get-go, we did a reading for the first time in Pace University in the basement. And Rob said, hey, I wrote this play for you guys. I want you to read it. There's a puppet. I'm going to bring an oven mitt. We weren't, there wasn't going to be a, a hand puppet at the reading. And I was like, I, you know, I, half of what I do in this role is the hand puppet. So I Googled easiest puppet to make. It was a sock puppet. I was like, well, the puppet needs to do a little bit more than a sock puppet, so I put some arms on him, and that was the prototype of Tyrone, the demonic sock puppet. And from the get-go, it was Jason and Tyrone. You've never seen anything like it. And that was when I knew we had something, because this show is so funny. I read the script before my audition, and I couldn't read it fast enough. I, I found it to be just fascinating and surprising and so real. I related to every single character, and I said to you know my agent I was like if I don't book this I just can't wait to see it it's just such an incredible piece so I was in love with it before I ever got the part and getting the part was just pretty awesome it's so hard to do the things that I have asked them to do yeah and that this man has helped me ask between them the puppetry to do. and the, and the constant stage combat I mean the, it's really tremendous and not only that but emotionally and uh, physically they just give all of themselves to this yeah. piece the amount of passion that they put into their show every single night and they are sick they are injured they go on and they are just you know we're all just exhilarated right. nobody can sleep because right. we're just every night we get to do the show and right. it just fills us with this kind of energy you sure. know that the audience gives us it's unbelievable right. so Steve has lost 200 pounds. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> he was on America's Biggest Loser. That's, no, yeah. but and we should market the hand to God diet. The right, hand to God exactly. diet. That's we what should market that. Also, yeah. You know, you, you work in this business and you feel like so many of the things you do, you believe in. You believe in all of them. But you wonder if anyone else is going to see what you see. And this feels like the show where audiences, you know, across the board have have seen what we see in it and in the story and in these characters and they recognize you know the the genius and the artistry of of Robert Askins and Moritz von Stolpnagel and they they get it and it's it's just incredibly gratifying to 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 have this story and these artists recognized in this way